Hey everybody, check out uh, High Flow Fuel Injection on Facebook and uh, don't forget to subscribe to my videos. Uh, today I wanted to show you something new that I'm trying out. Uh, it's a flex hone tool attached to uh, a drill. And this is for porting uh, TPI base manifolds, stock or aftermarket. Uh, this one right here is a 1 and 5 eighths and what I'm doing is after I'm done with the carbide work I, I run this through each port These are already done. But you get the idea. Uh, the drill will go up to 1500 RPM. You want to run this between uh, 500 and 800 RPM. And basically, what I'm doing is after I do the carbide work, it leaves a very rough finish inside the port and it takes quite a bit of time to to use the uh, 80, 80 grit cartridge rolls and to get the smooth finish so what I'm doing is I'll run this through each port after I've done the carbide work and it just smooths out the, the port a little bit, uh, smooths out the uh, carbide uh, work that I've done, and gets it ready for the uh, cartridge roll. Makes it a little easier to, a little quicker for me to do the cartridge roll work, the finishing work. And it, it also, it also opens the port up a little a little more not a lot but a little bit um, and get them nice and even um, eventually I'm gonna be going to this uh, one and three quarter inch I'm gonna try it out uh, I, I'm sure I could do it now uh, but I'm gonna wait a little while and try that out. But uh, yeah, the one and five eighths works pretty well. The ports are bigger than that, so when I have it, when I have the uh, flex hone in the port, uh, I move it around. You know, push it toward the top or toward the bottom, toward the side, go around like this, and it just—it's not really. I'm not really doing it to open up the port anymore, uh, even though it it might do a little bit of that. Um, what I'm like I said before, what I'm doing is uh, just uh, making the uh, carbide work a little more smooth before I do the uh, the cartridge roll work. But uh, yeah, it's it's a it's a pretty neat tool. You can get these online. But yeah, they uh, so far it seems pretty good. We'll see. It might not be, you know, it might not be something that I stick with. So I'll uh, I'll let you know how it goes. I'll have more videos about it later on when I get to the uh, the larger flex hone tool. But yeah, it's just a standard drill. Nothing special. But I, I just thought I would show everybody uh, that uh, it's something new that I'm trying out. Anything that, that makes the process easier, because this, uh, the, doing a TPI manifold is extremely time consuming. A lot of people don't understand the uh, work involved. There's a lot of metal on the inside to take out of each port. Uh, I spend hours and hours and uh, you don't want to do it for a long time in one, you know, in one sitting, so to speak. 
it's better to, you know, do a few ports, you know, stop for a while, take a break, and then come back to it. Um, maybe come back to it the next day. Because you don't want to rush a job like this. Uh, once you start rushing it, then it it's it just turns out like crap. So you're better off uh, taking a break and, and coming back to it. Uh, because it's just a better intake when you're done and you'll be much happier. My customers will be much happier. Um, like I said, I don't, I will never rush one of these intakes and it does take me a while to get them out sometimes. Right now I have four or five jobs left to do and uh, I got people waiting but um, I have to take my time in order to do it right so they have a good product in the end. But uh, yeah, check out more of my videos later on. Subscribe so you uh, you're updated. Uh, I'll have the more of the uh, Flex Hone um, tool videos coming up just to show you how it's going. But so far, so far I like it pretty well. Um, but if, yeah, if you're looking to have anything done, any kind of porting done, uh, get a hold of me on Facebook. Uh, high flow fuel injection check it out uh, click like uh, subscribe to my videos uh, the more the better uh, thanks for watching my my videos